Hi guys, I don't have much light, but this is the only time I can actually film my Super Junior Collection update, which I do yearly in December. And even though I'm waiting for a couple new Super Junior items, they won't arrive probably till January, so there's really no point in waiting more. And I actually have free time to do this, so it's a bit dark. And it's a complete circle around me because uh, it has reached 200 things. It's over 200. I'm not sure by how much. I think it's at least 210, but I'm not sure. So, yeah. I will try to do this as quickly as possible. So the first things I start with are not entirely Super Junior kind of things. So the first two are uh, su Sweet Memories with Super Junior and Heart to Heart with Super Junior, which are compilation albums, so they are not sung by Super Junior. Then collaborations, Show Me Your Love with the Machine Key, 2006 Summer, SM Town, then the Winter One, Snow Dream, 2007 Fragile, this is Summer One, then the Winter One is called Only Love, then the 2009 one for summer and then 2011 was the last and they had the winter one this is the silver version and here is the gold version so then we have SM the ballad the first one had only Kihyun in it then there's a second one here's the Korean version and the Chinese version for Henry and Chomi then OSTs I only have the Skip Beat OSTs it has a um, three versions, and this is the challenge version, I believe. Then the Spandler version, and the deluxe edition. So there's like three versions, but hmm. there is SJM songs on it. So yeah, and then let's go to the proper Super Junior collection. And oh, it's going to take long. First album, Twins. Then the Thai version of Twins. This is just a bonus DVD, same thing. It's on the, in this one, this is just an extra. Then first single, You. Then the Taiwanese kind of free package, which includes Dancing Out. Then second album, A version. CD plus DVD repackage. CD only repackage. And the digital disc repackage. Then here's the Japanese version, the CD only version of those there is the other one which I don't have yet. Then, third album, sorry sorry, A version, is the B version, C version, and the D version. This is a Taiwan special which is the same as Asia special. So, and there is the Japanese version. This is a limited one and the CD plus DVD one. So it's a repackaged version. So then, fourth album, Bonamana. Here's the A version, there's one of the covers and here's the other cover. And it's putting them in a B version. Sorry, it's dark. I try. I try. And there's the repackage. Then the Taiwanese uh, Asia special version. And it has three Japanese versions, which I got this past year. Here's the A version, it's Japanese version. Here's the B version. And there is a repackage in Japanese version. Then fifth album, this is simple. I have all the ten covers, so let's see. There is Etix. There is Hicha. There is Yesan. There is Shina. Oh, sorry. There is Tangmini. There is Inyagi. There is Dunkheads. Shivan, Ryok, and Kihan. So I have all these for a while now. Then there is the B version of Mrs. Simple, and the repackage Acha is here. Then for Sexy Free and Single, again I have all the 10 colors. So here's the white version. I'm going to show this one properly. So this is the A version, and there are the spines. <laughs> you can see them, it's so dark. You really can't see them. So there is a silver one, glossy gold, a glossy red and blue and orange, glossy gold, matte red, uh, matte gold, black and brown or glossy orange. So there's like 
all the ten colors. I have the I had these since they came out, so now I know they are hard to get. So and they are really hard to move. Then here's the B version of Sexy Free and Single. And here is the repackaged spy. And then for seventh album, Mamacita. I have one more than these, but here's the two covers of the A version. The first one is a misprint one, you won't be able to see it properly, but it's a misprint one and this is a uh, well, next press which is which has the correction. Then here's the B version of Marcita the repackage This is Love and the Taiwanese version repackage of This is Love. So this is an Asia, Asia special. These are the two donkey covers I have here. But I also have all the other members, so there is Etux, Revox, Canyons, another Donkey one, Hichel, Shivan, Sangmin, Shinang, Kihan, and Inyak. So I have these. Then uh, uh, 10th anniversary special album, Devil. And here is the repackage magic. I am planning to get 10 of each and I'm really close to that, but I didn't bring my extras because they are the same album. Then, on to solos. I do them in age order, so since it doesn't have a solo, I'm doing Kitchell first and it's MND. Uh, here's a Close Your Mouth promo CD. And here's the first mini album, uh, Cottage Industry. Then Hanging is next, obviously. Here's the limited edition of Gangsin. I'm going to get more versions. And here is the Hong Kong CD Press DVD version of Hope in the Darkness. And in dark, it's even more dark than it is. So, then here's Show Me's Rewind. Kian's first uh, mini album at Guang Famin. The second one is Fall once again. Henry's first mini album, Trap. Second one is Fantastic. Then the Japanese single Fantastic CD only version and the CD plus DVD version. So those were the solos. Now we move on to subunits. These are the three piles of subunits. Uh, Careby, this is an OST CD for Haina a Drama. This is the Taiwan version because this is the one which comes with them on the cover. The Korean one comes with a drama picture. Like, yeah. <laughs> so I got the Taiwanese one to have them on the front at least. And this has more than one song, that's why I have, because I don't really collect OSTs, neither do I do promo CDs, but yeah. There's Promise You, CD only version, then CD plus DVD version, and F version, that was the first single in Japan, then second one is Join Hands, CD only version, CD plus DVD version, and the F version. Then Super Junior T. Here's the Rokugo, the Korean version, the Taiwanese version with DVD, then the Japanese single Rock and Go, CD only version, and the CD plus DVD version, and here's an event version. Yeah. Then Super Junior M, here's the first full album Me, the Korean version, then the Asia Special version, which comes with the DVD. And here's a Me promo CD, this is just a song Me. Then first mini album Super Girl, the Korean version. Then Japanese version CD only. And CD plus DVD version. Then second mini album, Perfection. CD only version Korean. And the repackage. Yeah, and then Japanese version CD only. And CD plus DVD. I need more light, but there is no more light. Oh, second full album, Breakdown. Like, I'm going crazy. It's all because of the stupid plant my parents pretty much collect and swing. Like, the natural light doesn't even come into our home. Home. Yeah. Then, Super Junior Happy, and the first and only mini album, Cooking Cooking. Here's the Asia special version. Sorry, I got a bit distracted. So there was the third main album, Swing, and you know that. <laughs> and Victory Korea is another release which is almost Super Junior Happy, so it belongs here. 
Then Dong Hyun Yun Yuk is the last subunit and definitely the one who has the most. <laughs> the Korean release is the Beat Goes On, the mini album. Then here's the special version. Then first Japan single Opa Opa CD only version, CD plus DVD version and the Elf version. Then I Wanna Dance CD only version, CD plus DVD version. F version, first full album, Write Me CD only version, CD plus DVD version, F version, bonus F Japan DVD, next single is Skeleton CD only version, CD plus DVD version, F version, then first Japan mini album, present CD only version, uh, the tour had a slip cover. So yeah, I got a CD only to put on the sl slipcover. Then the CD plus DVD version, Elf version, and present tour also came with a different version of the mini album. Then uh, their last, latest, last single for a while, Let's Get It On, CD only version, CD plus DVD version, Elf version. And here is the bonus F Japan DVD. Then, uh, now we go on to Super Junior singles and full albums in Japan, so Japanese releases in Japanese language, because the Korean albums released in Japan still have the Korean uh, songs, uh, but these are in Japanese. <laughs> First single, U Twins uh, CD only version, which is a Mumo version. The CD plus DVD version is like a normal version. But they also have an event version from the first premium event, premium event in Japan. So that was the first single. The second single is Marry You, which is a CD only version. CD plus DVD version. And the Mumo version. And then first actual single, I'm not sure why they never counted this, but yeah. Uh, Bijin, CD only version. They have a prettier back. And CD plus DVD version again. The back is like that. Then Mumo version has CD plate. <laughs> then the Sunkus version. And second single, Mr. Simple CD only version. CD plus DVD version, simple jewel case version. And there is the limited version of the CD plus DVD version. Then there is a tour version from Super Show 4 in Osaka. And there is another tour version, which is also called the Mumo version, um, because it came in a box which had other goodies, and that box could be bought at Super Show 4 in Osaka. So they are both tour versions in a way. This is a CD plus DVD version. Then Opera is the third single, CD only version. The special CD only version was a puzzle piece, I only have done hits so far. Then there is a CD plus DVD version and the AF version. Of course there's a tour version, it's from Super Show 4 in Tokyo this time. And then, here's Sexy Free and Single, the fourth single, uh, CD only version. And there's the limited CD only version. <laughs> and then, CD plus DVD version. And the AF Japan version. Then Hero, the first full Japan album, also had a tons of versions. CD only version, CD plus DVD version, and the regular one, and this is actually the Korean press, but same thing came out in Japan as well. And here is the limited version, which is super tall, as you can see. And yeah, it's really tall. <laughs> Here's the elf version. And the tour version was a playing card set, so this is actually only a music card with a code where you can download the album. It's version 5 in Tokyo. Now, um, Blue Word is the fifth single, CD only version, CD plus DVD version, Elf version, then what is the sixth Japan single, Mamacita, CD only version. And did I mess up? Oh yeah, there's like the CD plus DVD. There's no regular CD plus DVD, what I was thinking. So there's the limited one. So yeah, it's in the sleeve, so it's really the lamp. You can see the lamp there. And there's the elf version. 
and the app version came with a limited Japan, like app Japan disc DVD. See, oh, the bling bling. <laughs> And that was it for Japanese releases. Of course, Devil and Magic, I ordered it, and it's getting released in January, so I'm going to get it in January. All three versions, I pre-ordered them. And then, movie, Attack on the Peanut Boys OST CD, Korean version, the video CD version of the movie, limited DVD version, Lim ultimate edition, like, again, DVDs, and here's the Taiwanese version. It's it's different, like how it looks like and everything. That's the extra for the DVD in Taiwan. It's a notebook. Then Super Show and other tour things. Many, 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 many things. <laughs> so Super Show 1 CDs. The live CD. Then Super Show 2. Yeah, there's the rest of the members. Then Super Show 3. And then in Japan came out a special edition thing for Super Show 3 in Japan. And it's kind of like a mini album and it's, it's half belongs here, half belongs other elsewhere. So it's just here, like see the only version is here. Like see it has the same picture. But this is a Bonamana A picture for the CD plus DVD one. And it has a third version which I don't have. And Super Show 4 CDs, Super Show 5 and 6 CDs. Oh, ooh, so pretty. And there is a bonus Elf Japan DVD for Super Show 5, which I have. I'm still missing other of this thing. Then let's get into the DVDs. It's not only Super Show, but events. So, because I keep all these in time order, how they happened. There's Super Show 1 DVD, Korean, obviously. And first premium event in Japan DVD. Super Show 2 in Korean. The light is so poor. Then, first uh, premium live in Japan, so not first, premium live in Japan DVD. Then, uh, Carewise's first concert in Japan. This is a, like, not an official one, but yeah, this is the only way you can get the concert on DVD. Super Show 3 in Korean DVD, in Japan DVD. And then, for Super Show 4, here's the Korean DVD. And there's the Japanese limited DVD thing with five DVDs. And actually, after three years, I managed to buy the Blu-ray. So the Blu-ray is on its way. It's just, I'm not sure how long it takes to arrive. Then, Alibaba Super Junior Treasure Within Us DVDs. So many DVDs. And then, uh, Fan Club Event 2012 uh, in Yokohama Arena. Okay, okay, whatever, I can't even pronounce it, so... In Yokohama, that's the point. <laughs> then, the second concert of KRY, which was 2012 winter concert. Again, not official. Then, Super Show 5 in Korea DVD. In Japan, normal DVD edition. Limited DVD edition. Blu-ray. Then, uh, Air Japan Fan Festival. 2013 DVD. Then Donkey Kong Next for Japan Tour uh, limited DVD edition in Japan, yeah, and uh, limited Blu-ray. I have that one also. Then for Super Show Six in Japan, I have the limited DVD edition DVD version, and the Korean one is not released yet. And there is the second tour of Donkey Kong Um Yeah, yeah, limited DVD again. And Carewise tour is not here yet, and since I'm never sure about Yes Asia how they work, I didn't wait for that one. But you will see an unboxing. I hope it's soon. So, yeah. And then for the books, I blog my way as usual because I can't do it any other way. So there are the Super Show ones first. There's Super Show three. There's Super Show four in a box. That's normal. And there is Super Show 5, which is much prettier. <laughs> then for Boys in City, there's Boys in City 1. There's Boys in City 2, which comes in this giant box with a calendar. There is Boys in City 3, which is tinier but heavier. It is really heavy. And what's even more heavy is the Boys in City 4, which is in Paris. And it's a limited edition. I don't have the normal ones, so... Yeah. 
let's move these because I have more things and these are the Hawaii food books here is Aloha and here is Mahalo it's not even focusing <gasps> then other bonus extra food books any kind of things which are not entirely super junior just subunit or maybe entirely super junior just not really going to a place kind of food books or super show food books so here's the skip beat food book which I have so Besides the drama itself, I actually have everything for Skip Beat I wanted. Um, here is a uh, Hichu's food book, uh, like when he was in the army, it's a Chinese, ver Chinese version. Then Alba Super Junior preview food book. So this is for the DVD, but it was released like a week before or something. So yeah, mine has a thing going on there. But, yeah, the other members are here, of course. <laughs> then they have a tour book, Experience Korea. And yeah, this is the first one, it's here. It's like the same cover for the second one as well. Then, here's a postcard set for it. <laughs> Show Me's Thai Perfect, which is again a tour, tour book. Then, Don Kenny First Japan Tour DVD. A uh, DVD? Yeah, food book, obviously, from the concert. Sorry about all those cables and stuff. <laughs> then, for Junior M uh, Guest House, uh, Let's Play in South Korea, food book, tour book kind of thing. And Super Junior LED uh, Swiss Diary. Ah, kind of like that. Sweet of Day of Japan Festival 2015 food book. This is a proper photo shoot and a tiny food book for it. And the latest one is Kiarawai's uh, third Japan tour phonograph food book. So I don't have the DVD, but I have the food book already. Hopefully the DVD arrives soon enough. So I know this video is long, but I don't know. I'm just not so hyper to do this even quicker. I don't know what I'm going to do next year, but I'm going to do something. <laughs> so... Um, I don't know, I just have so many things and now I have to clean everything. Clean everything so I can put them these back prettily on the shelves. And I did get new thing like all the new things, like other things, but not as many as before. It's mainly because they are expensive, the things which I'm missing now. So I can't buy them as often as I used to. Because somehow I feel like buying more more of the cheaper things is easier than buying one expensive thing so that's how I end up getting less of their old stuff but I'm still getting every single of the new things and sometimes I'm getting, I'm getting older stuff like I got the blu-ray version of that one which is super exciting because I've never seen the photo book of that one um, but of course like the KRY DVD is on its way the new Japan single is on its way beside that so I'm getting the new stuff <laughs> Um, except for SM Town, but that's on my list as well. Just not now. <laughs> but yeah, so as you can see, I have many, many, and I'm going to have even more. And I hope next year when I can do this update, I will have more light because this video is ugly. I'm sorry about that. So hmm. I hope for the best for next year that I can get many of their older stuff, at least like enough. Let's just say, like, I can get enough so it makes me happy <laughs> bye thank you for